Hey there, Sharon Hornellstrom here. And my question for you today is what do you what do you do when you're tired to supersize and grow your business? I thought it'd be fun today, after a sleepover and being very tired yesterday, to share 23 tired idioms. So I looked up a list of 23 tired idioms or idioms that have to do with saying that we're tired or feeling tired, and then ask you what do you actually do when you're feeling tired to grow and supersize and, and keep your business going? I'll share a couple of my things at the end, but first let's hop into those 23 tired in idioms and then pick your favorite below. Which one do you use most often? And share that in the comments below. To be dead tired, dog tired, to wear someone out, to be pooped. I would say I, I, would say I used to, I'm pooped. Very often, meaning I'm tired. I think that's one that we laughed about in my family. Uh, to be spent, to be out like a light. I wish that we, I could be out like a light some days. Dead on one's feet, ready to drop, to be beat, to be drained, to be tuckered out, to be shot, to be wiped, sleepy ahead. I use that one a lot too with my granddaughters. Um, one's bed is calling them. To barely be able to keep one's eyes open, to burn the candle at both ends, to burn out, to zonk someone out, to run out of steam, to be dragged out, to be on one's last leg, and out of gas. I'm sure there's more. These are just a quick list of some that I came up with. So share in the comments below, what is your favorite way of expressing when you're exhausted, tired, pooped? can't take another step for can't take a step further what that's we're not even on the list dead on one's feet pooped dog tired dead tired a lot of them are um, similar they all mean of course to be exhausted tired burnt out need a break need a rest so what do you do in your business to keep the business moving forward even though you absolutely positively need to take a rest a break a time out a vacation a breather whatever you call it. Share that in the comments below so that we can learn from one another. And I will be with you tomorrow with another interesting idiom. What does it mean? Where does it come from? And how might you use it in your business and your life? And maybe I'll share in the comments below what I do when I'm pooped. Have a great day and I'll be with you tomorrow.